You never know if you could end up in those type of spots. So just always hustle to the ball. It rewards you even when you don't think you will. So you see on the tape, Kendall getting mad because he wanted to <laughs> get it. Oh my God. I think I replayed that probably like three, four times after the game. I was laughing hard because he was telling me uh, on the sideline that he didn't even know I picked the ball. So I was like, oh yeah, like I was right behind you, dude. You didn't even know it until he heard everybody screaming. That's why you see on film, he's pointing. He like, oh. <laughs> so that was fair. That was a fun moment for me and Dolby. Especially since we uh, had one in uh, Arizona too. Yeah. I say the tip pad, or oh, he tipped the ball and I picked the ball. So we kind of feel like our aura is like t plus like 20,000 right now. I don't know. I don't know. Did, did Saturday night kind of feel like a, just a culmination of just your transformation from when you first got here to to now? Uh, I can agree with you. But uh, I also feel like, mm, yeah, I, yeah, I can agree with you. I feel like I had a lot of stuff to overcome, like off the field and on the field that, shoot, my guys, teammates and coaches, even like everybody didn't help me with, like soul mission and all. And yeah, I mean, it's coming to display. We ain't done, job's not done. Say it's only the first game, but we definitely gonna see a lot. How much has your game improved? Just when you look at that cornerback room, it seems like the depth right now is about as good as it's been in a while around here. Oh yeah, our depth is crazy. We got guys that could literally go anywhere and start day one. And that's one thing like, that helps me get better. Cause like, I know them guys are good. And like, it can be a next week or within probably a couple more plays where they getting their rhythm and boom, your spot can be gone. So it always keeps you on your toes. Like, we got great guys. I say, y'all seen the debut from Dez. Y'all seen, and he got a lot more coming from that. We got Dez, Gentry, Woody, literally everybody, Jacoby. We got Macari. So it definitely, it keeps keeps everybody on their toes and everybody wants to work hard to get that spot. So, I mean, jobs never, like I said, and again, jobs never finished. So it can either be me or be somebody else. Coach V was talking about in fall camp. He said you were the most consistent corner on the team. We feel like got you to that point. Uh, you just been consistent. Figuring out everything, I had to figure out off the field. That was a lot. Like, like I said, I had to mature a lot. So everything off the field that I wasn't understanding, like for example, could be time management or something like that. Like, I feel like everything off the field translates to everything on the field. Shoot, I had some, you know, mental battles I had to face. I had to get over them for myself. And it just helped me keep a clear mind. Like, it helped me keep a clear space for myself. Like, I feel fresh, you know how I would say. So I felt like that just translates. So, like as we say, how you do anything, how you do everything. So once everything started online, it was just kind of like, boom. I mean, I have my ups and downs, but it's always just – Straight on. It's a little bit of a different position, but just in terms of what Kendall's doing at that cheetah position, how good, how special is he in this defense? What they're asking him to do? That boy, a dog. Yeah. Straight like that. That boy, a dog. Like covering, blitzing, all that. That boy, a dog. So he plays a big role in our defense. I love Adobe. Like I said, Adobe like my one too. So yeah. I love Adobe a lot. The six trainers on Friday. What can something like that do for the defense going forward? Uh, send a message, and also like keep it conscious for us, like, cause shoot, of course we all got the rankings and all that stuff, and that's cool too. But like, those actually mean something when we put up points and we're stopping them, we're stopping their momentum. So like, that all like we keep it conscious in our head to always get at the ball, get at the ball, like go after the ball because you like I said you never know what could happen even if the ball's in the air or even if the ball's on the floor I think it was one play where I even screwed up I was thinking like we already had the ball meanwhile the ball's still rolling on the floor and I was like dude like after looking at film I was like oh my god because I really could have scooped that up but shout out to DT too because he scooped it up and he was paying attention so that turnovers it's a big role like points and all yards and all plays a big role in how we do everything. How much has Coach Alley helped you just since he's gotten here? That boy is a D1 
defensive geek. I give him, I tell my hat to him, like he's a defensive geek. And of course, you know, everybody thinks that we might have just V and you know, V is always here and he's here the same day, he's the same person every single day. But adding them two, that was a dangerous combination because it can be something that V don't see that Coach Ali will pick up on. So then if Coach V has a question about it, Coach Ali literally boom, we like, we got this, 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 this. So he'll have the answer for whatever. Like, yeah, Coach Ali, I'm glad Coach Ali came here. <laughs> it's gonna be real interesting.